I was a good football player last year. I wasn't technically the best athlete. I feel like I just wanted to be stronger. In terms of just uh, where I was last year versus where I am now, I'm 100% like way stronger than what I was. So I live faster. Uh, it's just some small things I feel like I can clean up to make myself a better football player. And the Lions, they get a victory beating the Chiefs here at GEHA Field at Arrowhead Stadium. I kind of see the positive as a, us playing as a unit. Uh, guys came in, uh, locked in on the game plan. Uh, tackling was one of the things we couldn't improve on, but I feel like early in the game, man, we started off tackling very well. Communication-wise, man, it was a loud, loud stadium, man, the environment was crazy. Every guy knew what they were doing every, every play, so I kind of feel like we're turning in the right direction. I always got to find a way to make those plays. I don't think Jacksonville gets the credit right now of being an AFC contender, but after the week that we just saw, they ought to be, and the Chiefs are going to need everything to beat this team. We played them actually twice last year. Now, the first time we played them, man, they were still trying to figure out their way, figure out their identity. Uh, then the last time we played them, they were able to throw the ball around, get the ball to pass, catch it out in space. They uh, present a great test for us. We just got to go out there and execute a game plan, tackle better, um, and just find a way to get off the field. I mean, things that I'm looking at from a Jacksonville perspective is Travis Etienne, who might be the best running back that no one is talking about. Yeah, we saw what he did uh, this past week. He um, was able to do with the ball on the perimeter, get out in space and uh, get to second level and make guys miss. And um, he makes fast DBs look slow. Uh, so it's our job to kind of make him stop and restart, uh, get him to go a little lateral and um, just kind of use the front the front guys to kind of handle the run and let the back end do their thing. So it's going to take all seven guys in the front uh, to limit his explosive gains. And uh, yeah, it's going to take the secondary to come out and make tackles if he does. So. Uh, we understand how the explosive he brings to our, uh, their team and the challenge he presents to us. So we just got to go out there and tackle. 